Back to school time for the Gardner Edgerton School District, but not for all of their kids. KCTV 5 Stephanie Kayser explains why only some went back. I'm here at Gardner Elementary School where class started for kindergartners today. High schoolers were also supposed to return, but the district pushed that back to Monday. While parents walked their little ones into their first day of school with high fives from their principal, parents of high schoolers have a few more hours of summer. We just wanted to make sure that our facility was absolutely perfect and ready for our kids and we needed to give our teachers a little bit of breathing room as well. Principal Mark Meyer says they are busy putting the final touches on their new building. By pushing it back a day, it's also given us a couple days over the weekend if we need that time as well. The year-long project was threefold. Students will come back to 18 new classrooms. There is also a standalone trails facility that is for students 18 to 21 years old who were enrolled in a living skills program. And now students can pick up more college and career skills in a new advanced technical center. It's almost like a brand new beginning. Meyer says it also gives the district room to expand in the future. This year, 100 new students will walk through the doors, and the district now has room for 400 more students than last year. I have 15 additional staff members now uh, to help compensate for some of the growth that's coming our way, and so we're, we're ready and built for the future. Freshmen and new students start Monday. Sophomores, juniors, and seniors start Tuesday. In Gardner, Stephanie Kayser, KCTV 5 News.